There was no mistaking who the star of the day was as the autograph hunters huddled around new manager Alex Ferguson, the players slipped by almost unnoticed. Out on the pitch it was the same. The United fans were nearly drowned by the sound of the cameraman's shutters as Ferguson took his place in the hot seat. But the name on the lips of all the Oxford fans was John Aldridge, their million pound striker, who wants to leave the manor. He brought them the lead after 16 minutes when Moran chipped him inside the box. And as he slammed home goal number 14, the Irish international must have gone to the top of most managers' wanted list. A few moments later, Aldridge had the alarm bells ringing again, but this time the Manchester men held out. With Ferguson looking on from the director's box, his players weren't making a very good first impression. This break from Peter Barnes was about the best they had to offer. There was no stopping the Oxford charge though, and fullback Neil Slatter was only inches away from making it two just before the break. Alex Ferguson's first half time talk seemed to have some effect on United and produced this effort from Frank Stapleton. Oxford was still in command though, and David Leeworthy could have made more from this shooting chance. But with 10 minutes to go, Oxford came up with the answer. A half-cleared corner, Houghton put the pressure back on. Brock supplied the next cross, and Neil Slatter hit home number two. Oxford eased off then, and United nearly got a goal back in the dying minutes through Clayton Blackmore. So problems for Alex Ferguson, but despite the victory, news that John Aldridge wants to leave the manor could bring a few worries Oxford's way.